There he is. Good one, Jason. <laughs> it was a cool strike. It hit on the drop. Pull her up out of there. There's weeds out there. <laughs> they just dig. He's trying to hide under the boat on us. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. There, that's a nice fish. Look at that. That's just a gorgeous smallmouth. That is beautiful. When you get into midsummer in Minnesota, you know, fishing offshore is a big deal. Fishing weed lines, coontail, those big milfoil edges, those weed walls, and all terrain it has a jig for any situation that you encounter in that environment. Decent fish. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a nice fish. Nothing says Minnesota bass fishing more than all-terrain tackle. We got all kinds of different head shapes here, you know, from the regular all-terrain rattling jig to some Grassmaster jigs, flipping a little bit heavier cover, football jigs, really kind of what started the all-terrain deal in Minnesota with Jim Moyna and, and Steve Hauge, the founder of all-terrain tackle. You know, Lake Minnetonka, you know, really pioneered that technique and all-terrain's sort of been there from the start. Milfoil flipping, all the lakes in Minnesota starting to get more and more milfoil, heavier cover, a lot of flipping. And that's where the Grassmaster jig really kind of comes in. And then you have our best seller here, the all-terrain rattling jig and great wood jig. Fishing rocks, fishing weeds, coontail, milfoil, good head shape for that. So those are a few of the ones we have. Of course, finesse jigs, swim bait heads, huge assortment of colors, whether it's you know your dark waters, your standard stuff, your black and blues, your browns. That is a beauty, isn't it? That's a nice one. Yeah, that'd be a nice one anywhere in the country, but I tell you what, <laughs> there are so many quality bass in this state. Boy, this is a respectable fish. Look at this. Look at that. That's a healthy one right there. <laughs> <laughs> so really all trains been there from the start pioneering that offshore fishing in Minnesota. If you pick up some of these jigs, you're gonna catch more fish.